to create an interlocking logo design using your letters this is how to do it type the first letter which is letter d we are using d and g for this design so let's change the font to Montserrat bold Montserrat bold so this is the first letter copy the letter directly to retain the font and the text size so edit and put g as the second letter now can you see align it to the center now if you look at this we need to interlock one of these parts it is either we interlock here or we interlock here now i'll use the upper part to do mine now the secret there is that you need to copy this letter d copy the letter d but first make sure your g is black the g must be in a different color from the d you are using to cut out the parts you want to cut so this is the letter d if you put it on it now make sure it is on the same spot just like the other d so you check using your movement option on pixel lab so move it directly on your g now we have to create something out of this before we can match to the g now look at this go to shapes select any shape of the same color with the d that is white this is a square i'll make it very small and place it on the d can you see once you click ok can you see it, it is already on the d now go to the layers and merge it together with the d click the d and select also the shape activate it it will ask you do you want to match match the shape with the letter d that you are using the one at the top the second d just leave that the g leave it and now if you look at it you can crop it now it is now a shape no more a test so it is on that shape that you can edit this so you go to crop and then move it up to like the middle of the letter something like this it shouldn't pass the middle like this so once you do that activate it then you have something like this can you see so place it back on this spot that you have it before and then you match it with the letter g not the d so the one you cut which is this and this can you see the two letters you want to match the next d will be the background the back so the one at the top of the g and the g will be matched together so match it together once you match it together can you see what you have you can see this so if we come here now can you see make sure it is matched together make sure you get to this point take it back to where it is and go straight to erase color you can even use this option to remove backgrounds and manipulate shapes and text so click on erase color that is here so once you click on erase color you activate the erase color now you can't know that it has disappeared because we have another d at the back so let's see can you see so this is what it will give you once this one is out of the shape or the letter g it will give you what you want as an interlock so you can then go ahead to change the color of your shapes or text so now that you've erased the color of the part you had it to g you can then change your letter d color by going to you change the color of letter d or you can even add texture to it can you see depending on the color you want to use 